She would have liked a bit more than that for her routine. What do you think? Are you a little bit harsh on her? Yeah, it was quite a, a low mark, but I think that's one of the things that's coming out with this code is it's very difficult to actually mark the gymnasts unless they put the movements in, and some of her balances and pirouettes weren't particularly strong. So here we go now with uh, Sara Moro. This time on the floor. It's a very dramatic Spanish leotard she's got on there. She is fast. Quite a slight girl. Plenty of zip about it. It's amazing, these very difficult combinations of somersaults and twists these girls do. Superb, that one. Not that one, though. Bit of a fall out of that spin. Preparing again for one of her tumble runs. She landed that quite well. floor routine, you're looking for a combination of power and artistry on this piece of apparatus. Seemed to nail the last one pretty firmly too. Didn't seem to have much sparkle though about that at the end. A lot of good technical parts to this routine though. Just under nine in her semi-final routine on the beam when she had that uh, one nasty moment. And she got up there in the nines with this one. Huge speed, accuracy as well. And just doesn't quite stand firm at the end. But that's pretty good, I think, overall. And uh, Kano there, playing the Joker, 16.4, so they quite liked his last effort, having uh, fallen off that high bar twice. Still manages to get uh, not too bad a mark. Well, they obviously liked what he actually did do then, when he wasn't on the floor. They did. And 9.362, good marks for Saramoro.